Ammonium sulfate precipitation. This is a technique to purify enzymes, proteins from chunks of other proteins or from the solution itself. So let me give a brief introduction about this technique. Solubility of proteins is affected by the ionic strength of the medium. If the ionic strength is increased, protein solubility at first increases and this refers as salting in. However, beyond a certain point, the solubility starts to decrease and this is called as salting out. As I have mentioned, ionic strength of the medium determines protein solubility. Two important terminologies, salting in and salting out. So, when ionic strength is increased, protein solubility at first increases and at a certain point, the solubility decreases. This is known as salting out. So what happens in this technique, let me show you with the color. This is a beaker or a container containing the solution or the solvent, maximum part is the solvent of a solution, the maximum part of a solution is the solvent and solvent is the liquid component as we know. So, if these are the proteins, so what happens is like when we add salt like ammonium sulfate, this salt try to get attached with these proteins and stabilizes the protein but this is for some time as I've mentioned when the ionic strength is increased protein solubility at first increases so when we add ammonium salt it stabilizes the protein structure this is called as salting in but we keep on adding the ammonium sulfate salt in the solution what happens the ionic strength increases and these salts are now gets attracted to the solution that is the water component or the liquid component and the protein accumulates at a Place, place or precipitate at a certain place so after that we take out once it is precipitated this is called as pellet not pellet it is precipitated at some place okay so after that we do centrifugation that is we rotate this solution at some rpm at for some time then the supernatant which is formed that is the liquid component is extracted out and what is left behind after centrifugation is the crude protein or the desired protein which we want to obtain. So this is the actual method of doing ammonium sulfate precipitation. Now what are the requirements? Enzyme sample, sample buffer, magnetic stirrer, beaker and spatula procedure ammonium sulfate of different concentrations to be weighted that is 20% to 100% sample to be kept on magnetic stator to mix well and then sodium solid ammonium sulfate is added slowly keep it overnight at 40 degrees centigrade for complete precipitation after the centri after that centrifuge the sample at 1000 rpm for 15 minutes separate the supernatant from the pellet and thereafter suspend the pellet in 1 ml 
sample buffer. There is no need to remember this procedure. This is you are going to apply when you do the practical. So only the theory is important.